the use of artificial intelligence becomes more accepted across all industries, we are looking at the role it plays within news organizations. Results from a nationwide survey conducted by the group Trusting News show a vast majority of respondents would like to know when, why, and how journalists are using AI. This summer, we here at KXAN participated in that study on journalism and AI. KXAN's Tom Miller talked to the organizers about what they found. You just conducted this research project looking at artificial intelligence in news. What was your big takeaway from the results and what you found? Yeah, the biggest takeaway is that 94% of people said that they want the use of AI by journalists disclosed. So that was very clear. They want to know why journalists decided to use AI. They want to know um, how journalists decided to still be ethical and accurate about that use of AI. And really important is they really do want to know that a human was still somehow involved in fact checking and editing and verifying and kind of making sure that that accuracy, that fairness, that ethical use was there. I know some specific use cases were asked about. What were people most opposed to when you gave examples of how it could potentially be used? Yes, yeah, so people are most opposed to AI being used in news when it comes to creating or using it as like an actor. So like a fake in a fake person, a fake newscaster, um, using it to actually be the audio for something where it's not someone's real voice. How important is factoring in the ethical implications and the accuracy implications? How important is that to the media companies that you're talking with? We have to be thinking about how it is still meeting our standard of accuracy, our standard of responsible reporting, and our standard of ethics. In most newsrooms that I have spoken with and that I've worked with, that is something they are taking very seriously. Lynn Walsh with Trusting News, thank you for talking with me. And we want to disclose our own AI use here at KXAN. We currently use it to spell check and to transcribe some interviews with human review. Tools can also suggest web story headlines or summaries for our journalists to consider. Our weather department also uses it to analyze the pollen count too. We do not use it though to write stories for voiceovers or to anchor any of our newscasts.